seem to be getting bigger in size and larger in number the closer we get to election day. But in Lake County, a race pitting incumbent representative Sam Yingling and his Republican challenger Rob Jurbinski. To put it mildly, there have been some problems there. NBC5 political editor Carol Marine explains. My opponent sent out a mailer to thousands of households that featured somebody who was not me. This is just one of the flyers that arrived in the mail in the 62nd House District in the far northern suburbs of Lake County. Paid for, it says, by the Illinois Republican Party. But that's not Yingling in the car in the photo that's been doctored with $100 bills flying out the back. It's a photo of Yingling's supporter, Jacob Meister. Meister claims he's been defamed, and photographer Quentin Galvin says his copyrighted photo was ripped off. They've hired attorney David Axelrod. No, not Barack Obama's David Axelrod, another one. And they are preparing a lawsuit. The people who sent out the flyer have acted unlawfully, and my clients are entitled to legal redress. But that's not the only factual problem with the flyer, according to Yingling. The mailer states Yingling backed the increase in the state's income tax. Trouble is, the bill was passed in 2011, and Yingling wasn't elected until 2012. Americans for Prosperity, funded by the Koch brothers of Texas, according to this flyer, chipped in for a different attack on Yingling. Here comes another oops. Call Sam Yingling to complain about House Speaker Mike Madigan, the mailer said, except the listed phone number is not for Yingling, but for fellow Democrat Deborah Conroy. Yingling's opponent, Republican Rod Drabinsky, who canceled an interview citing scheduling problems, said in an email, the first I heard or saw of either of those mailers, they were already in the mailboxes. He counters Yingling has, quote, littered mailboxes with over 20 false attacks. Now, as for that wrong photo, yes, Jacob Meister considered a run for U.S. Senate back in 2010, and oh yes, like Yingling, he's gay. <laughs> and Yingling thinks it's pretty funny if anybody is suggesting that all gay men look alike. I don't necessarily think that this is a gay or straight issue. I think that this is just reckless behavior on the part of my opponent. Carol Marine, NBC5 News. That is a head shaker. We called but got no response from the Illinois Republican Party. Americans for Prosperity is a PAC and thus does not coordinate with any campaign. They likewise did not return our calls. So we all took a walk for dinner. And yes. it's so much nicer tonight than it was.